Hello everyone, welcome to TechSQL. So in this session, we are going to learn how to create user in Oracle database. To start as Oracle DBA, user creation is one of the frequent tasks we'll come across. So database user or ID is assigned a unique username when you, when you create a user in Oracle database. Users will log on to the database using that username and having logged in, users can issue various database SQL statements to create objects, query objects, and manage the database. In this session, we'll cover the creation of Oracle users with the Oracle create user command. The Oracle create user command is used to create database user accounts. When creating a user account with the Oracle user command, you can decide the username. So the username could be a uh, kind of uh, service account name used for application or uh, the developer account which the database developer will use to create different objects. You will have to decide the password associated with the DB user. Decide default table space, temporary table space, how much space you want to allocate to the user and what are the privileges you want to give to the user. So uh, let's go through the example of how to create a user. So the syntax is create user, user01, which is the username, identified by password, default table space users, temporary table space temp, quota unlimited on users, quota 500 megabytes on tblspc underscore data01. So in above example, we have used the oracle create user command to create user called user01. Use the identify identified by clause to define the password. Next we use the default table space keyword to define the location of the default table space which is users. The temporary table space keyword defines the temporary table space that will be assigned to the user which is in the which is in our case is a temp table space. We can also control the space allocation with the help of quota. So first table space is unlimited and the second which is tblspc underscore data 01 have been assigned quota of 500 MB. So basically uh, even if you create a user account it will not be able to do anything until you uh, have granted a basic set of privileges. Typically you would always grant uh, the create session privilege so that user can connect to the database. The grant command is uh, pretty uh, simple to use. You just need to know what privileges you want to grant and uh, who you want to grant the privilege to.